Blessed love brothers and sisters, this is Subi. Now I see some videos circulating on the internet. You know, with the brothers and the sisters them from the garrison. Who are not taking too kindly to this lockdown. I see some brothers and sisters that are fling stone off of the police and off of the soldiers them. When I just saw it, I was disappointed. I was like, yo, them people are star. But so I really, really check it. I did the wrong for even be disappointed people. Because you were going now. That is not my reality. You see, some of them people where you see a fling stone, you don't even know what kind of situation they have. You see some of them garrison building there. Some of them building they want to see in the ghetto. Them big tall building there. With the thick concrete. It absorb heat. Some of them people here. Yeah, all ten of them live in one of them house there. You know. Or one of them room there. Or two of them bedroom there. You know. Members here yeah, garrison this. You know. Members say yeah, at one point. Mama gone to work. Grandma gone to market. Man gonna dance, pit the gonna school, so everybody not really dead woman at the same time. Sometimes man I come from dance, pit me I go to school. Mama I go to work, man just I come from dance. Now nobody can go anywhere. So everybody bungle up in the same place. Them now go take kindly to that. Because here we go on now, you see the temperature. At Jamaica, it's over 90 degrees. Plus the body heat them. Plus the pot and the fire. Them are going to come out of the road to get breeze. Them, them, are, them, are, them are living a torment. You know what about hell? Right now some people in the garrison are going through hell. You know so when you're in all a hot house and your head start hurt you. You have to go a door to get breeze. Sometimes, what the people them stay seeing, I just a little damn or a little loady board from the corner where people just go bungle around it. A man just out there, a woman just out there until it get late and the time get cool and them just go in go sleep. Because I remember saying them take out our land and put it in a them slum here. And we just have to deal with what are going on right now. But we can't demonize them. We can't demonize them. And we not extenuate people are fling stone off a soldier and police. But we have to understand the frustration. We have to understand it. Because we not face them reality. We have to understand that. The government have to understand that. What we have to do now? We have to learn from these people. We have to learn from this and start look out for each other. So if this should happen again, we're better prepared for it. Because trust me, it's not easy upon some people right now. Some of we are going to just lose mama, lose grandma, lose grandpa, lose some family member. And I just saw it a go people. It's so it a go. But we ask people, if we just confirm overnight like that, it are difficult. Them now go can just confirm, so boom. Even when it is to protect them own self. Because trust me, you don't want in one of them get to there when the time gets hot and you have to go stay in your house and they might tell us you can't come out. You know, you can't deal with that. I mean, I don't know if me could have deal with that neither. Me don't want to get the breeze. You see me, I say? So, give me. I could not judge them. I could say if we can come together. And find a way how we can look out for them and reach out to them. Because we have a long road to go. And not just today alone, them are going to need a little help. And not just tomorrow. So even if you put the plan in place, well done. See, we could plan how we are going to start out this thing. Yeah. And if you can't help now, if you're up on the grounds now, and you find ways you can help, find ways and help. You see what I say? Because we're not prepared for that sort of people. Big up on yourself. Out.